Yo guys, Jupy here, bringing you another video. Today is my second episode of my top five Call of Duty series. I saw a great response on the last one. I hope we can do the same thing, if not more, on this video. So let's get right into it. This is the top five Black Ops 2 weapons. So regular weapons. Right now, there's going to be no equipment, no wonder weapons, or no melee weapons such as Bowie Knife or Galvan Knuckles. And I am taking into account, like, wall weapons are better since you can get more ammo from them. But I am also not taking into account Pack-a-Punch, because personally, I find guns like the Olympia are awesome once you Pack-a-Punch them, but in this video, that does not matter. So let us get right into it. Okay, so my number five that I've chosen is the Remington New Model Army from the map Buried. Now, you might think I'm a bit crazy on this one, but the only reason I really put it was because it's the best pistol in the game. Now, I could obviously put every single LMG in the game on this list, and that would make sense. But I'm not going to. I'm going to give a little variety, you know. So that's why I have the Remington New Model Army. Anyways, semi-auto, six rounds and out of 84 when in reserve when you first get it when you pack a punch it you get the sassafras yeah which is 12 and 96 in reserve and yeah that just about sums it up you know here's number four so number four is the stg 44 from the map origins it's a fully auto gun with 30 bullets and 210 in reserve and when you pack a punch it it becomes the spats 44 7 447 yeah where it gets 60 ammo and 330 in reserve, it's pretty good. It's one of the best wall weapons in the game, even though it's only on Origins, but yeah, it's, it's just, it's awesome. It's a great weapon. I'm pretty sure most other Call of Duties, it's the MP44, but still the same thing. That's what it was in Black Ops 1 Zombies. It was the MP44, said the STG44, but yeah, that's why it makes the number four on my list. So here comes number three, which I've chosen the M1927 or the Thompson from Mob of the Dead and Origin. Now, I'm choosing this kind of from like Mob of the Dead since it's a wall weapon, but you can get it out of the box in Origins, which is pretty sweet. And also, anyways, this is a fully auto. It's 50 with 350 in reserve when you first get it. When you pack a punch it, it becomes Speakeasy, which has 50 and 400 in reserve, which does not come better but yeah anyways but there's not really a whole lot to it it's a pretty awesome gun to use i almost always use it playing mob of the dead and that's the truth right there so now let's get into the final two now my number two is this one might be a bit controversial i put this down this is my favorite lmg in zombies but i pick the death machine from mob of the dead and yeah yeah so it's a fully auto of course it has 150 ammo with 300 in reserve so it's only three clips but then when you pack a punch it it becomes the meat grinder which then it has 550 ammo yeah 550 ammo clip i know with only 550 in reserve so max ammos don't help you a ton but it's just a boss you use it to like mow down everything the clip is so big it's just, it's so big, you almost never have to reload. And when you do, if you have speed cola, it's not a problem. It's like 0.8 seconds or something like that. But anyways, the, what we've all been waiting for, my number one is, drumroll, the war machine. Yeah, no, I'm just joking you. It's a Scar H from Origins. Now, you might not all agree with me on this one, but I think the Scar H is the best assault rifle and best gun in the entire Zombies. It has a very high amount of power. When, like, you're battling um, the Hansar Soldier in Origins, it's probably the best weapon against him, personally. And it's fully auto, 30 with 270 in reserve. When you pack a bunch, it becomes the Agarthan Reaper, just perfect with the map storyline. It has 40 ammo with 400 in reserve. Now you can get this weapon as a prize for when you like you um for when you get the 120 headshots. I think it is 115 headshots. Anyways, it's just like it's so powerful, and I that's why it deserves the spot. My number one for my top five weapons in Black Ops 2 Zombies. Now. If you've enjoyed this video, please drop a like. It means so much to me. And comment on what you think I should do my next top five on. I'm considering throwing one out for multiplayer, but I'm not sure if you guys enjoy these zombie ones better. Anyways, as always, I'm Jupy, and I will see you later.